Hello everyone, this is Thunder Collector here with another action figure review, and here we have the Marvel Legends series X-Men um, Marvel's Legion uh, from a second X-Men Apocalypse wave. So let's go over the packaging here first. So first we get the Marvel Legends logo here on the top, X-Men logo down here, Legion. Here is the side art with Apocalypse in the background with uh, Legion here looking all crazy. Here is the Age of Apocalypse logo here on the top here. Here's the other side art. Here is the back here with the details. If you guys want to pause and read that. Picture of Legion. Marvel Legends logo here on the top right. And then here's all the figures in the lineup to build Colossus from the Age of Apocalypse. You get Magneto, Rogue, Cyclops, Sabretooth, Jean Grey, Iceman, and Legion, which we're doing right now. And then here is the bottom with the DCBI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is Legion on the package here. So let's go over the accessories first. First, you get... Colossus' is right leg here, which we'll go over once we build them. I don't have any of the figures left in the wave. This is the only one that I have right now. And then we get two fists hands here for Legion. Same old hands we've gotten before. And then yeah, that's all we got for accessories for him. So let's go over Legion. So here is his head sculpt. Uh, you get this not really big flat head for him, black hair. It's all sticking up. You get that like little hair there that is kind of curled up. And then you get one eyebrow raised for him. You get green, green eyes, it looks like. And uh, you get that smirk or smile for him. And then you get the arms here. You still get the peg holes, I mean, uh, peg joints there for him. And then you get the open hands for him here and then you get this like uh hospital wear from uh blue hospital apron uh clothing here so he's wearing blue with the pants here too and then you don't have any shoes for him at all um and then for the clothing here uh they added some like paint to it so darker blue to give it more depth here which is pretty cool. You get some wrinkles in there. Continues all the way down through the pants. And then here's the back. They didn't do any of that in the back here. So yeah. Um, and then you still get the peg joints there for him. Uh, but yeah, that's all we really got for looks. So let's go over the articulation. So he has a disc ball joint here, which you can look down that far. Actually, no, not a disc ball joint. He has a dumbbell joint for his head so you can look down that far you can look up that far you can look left and right you got all sorts of crazy head pivoting in there shoulders can move out that far 360 rotation there bicep swivel double jointed elbows wrists can hinge down that far up that far 360 rotation there he has an ab, ab crunch you can go forward that much backwards that much he has a waist swivel 360 rotation there legs can kick out that far forward that far backwards not a whole lot thigh cut double jointed knees almost a butt kick and then ankles can hinge down that far really far and then up that far nice ankle pivot so yeah that's legion for you um i think he's a pretty cool figure uh he's kind of generic though um but it's not that bad uh the articulation is pretty good um i don't know much about this character besides uh, I think he is Professor X's son, and there was a show about him called The Gifted, I think on ABC, um, with Agents of the S.H.I.E.L.D., but this was owned by Fox. Um, so yeah, I don't really know much about this character, um, besides that he's Professor X's um, son, and he has like similar powers to his father. Um, but yeah, that's all I really got for this figure. It's not bad. I do recommend you get him if you want to expand your X-Men shelf like I am. Um, but yeah, that's all I really got for this figure. So, um, make sure you guys check out my link tree in my description for my, uh, TikTok, Twitter, uh, Twitch. Uh, but yeah, that's all I really got for this figure. So, thanks for watching.